Hello, I'm Chris from Guna Graphics and today I'm going to be making a Triskelion design. So this is the original find I'm going to base my design off. Um, this find, it was found at uh, Titelberg in uh, Kjörndé, Luxembourg. And there are four rivets. According to the museum, uh, the illustration depicted on it is a bird. I don't really see a bird. I see uh, three wings in the shape of a triskelion, or a triskelion made out of uh, three wings. So Titelberg was the oppidum of uh, the Treviri tribe. The Treviri tribe, located here, so current day Luxembourg, was a part of uh, Gallia Belgica. It was uh, dated to around uh, 200 BCE, uh, so at the time before the Roman conquest. So the document setup is an A4 document, uh, 300 dpi, CMYK colon. We start by putting a guideline in the middle, two circles of 770 millimeter, And the third circle in the middle, like this. So to determine what uh, the metal point is, we're going to take uh, the pen tool, go to the center of uh, the circle, and make a line like this. So. This is uh, the center of the three circles. In the center, we put another guideline. And we name this layer base. We add a new layer. We take the polar grid tool, two concentric dividers, zero radial dividers, with the direct selection tool, we're going to select the bottom half, cut it, paste in front, and move it up like this, we select all, Control J to join, and with the direct selection tool, cut out this line. We select one of the curls, so to do that we're gonna right click and ungroup, and delete one of the curls. The remaining curl we gonna resize Like this. We change the color. And with the pen tool, we continue this line until this point. With the rotate tool, 
from the middle 120 degrees copy and copy again uh, now we can put the visibility of the base layer out off and this layer we're gonna call shape Um, select all, copy, log the layer, add a new layer, paste in front, rename it Triskelion, put the visibility of uh, the shape off, and we're gonna change the stroke width. To 35 with a rounded cap. Mm -hmm. You go to Objects, Path, Outline Stroke, and with the Pathfinder, we unite. Uh, this we're going to clean up a bit. At the Shape Builder tool, remove these parts. Same thing over here. Like this. Um, so we select a triskelion. Uh, swap the fill and the stroke. And the stroke on the outside. So the inner width is a uh, 35. So the outer width we're gonna make. 30. Select all, object, path, outline stroke. Okay. We lock this layer, we add a new layer, uh, put the visibility back on of the base layer. So we have our middle point. We select a contrast and color. From the middle. I'm gonna make a circle until here. Uh, copy the circle, paste in front. By this point uh, we can put the visibility back off of the base layer. And move the second circle to below. Like this. Locked layer. Uh, put the visibility of the shape back on. Select the upper shape. So we start by selecting these two points. Delete them. Change the color. And resize it until 
we reach this point. So stroke. Like this. We go to object of outline stroke. Release. Click to unite. We put a stroke. Put layer below the triskelion. And resize it. Resize the stroke width to the outside. 35 points. Object of outline stroke and group um, right click release the compound path click to unite Put on stroke. To the outsides, 30. Same thing again. Objects, path, outline stroke, and group. Release, click to unite, arrange send to back, we add a stroke, to the outside, and 35 objects of outline stroke and group select a green release unite arrange center back So this is what we're going to need. We're going to put these three layers together. With the Shape Builder tool. Start with removing these. This we also don't need. So green is um, selected, so if we unite these, they're going to be in green.
these two parts we're gonna unite, but not just yet. With the direct selection tool, we're gonna select these four points. Okay, we needed to uh, simplify it. Too many anchor points. So with the direct selection tool, select these four points. Like this. We go with the pen tool. From this point until about here, like this. You do the same thing over here. with the direct selection tool this point and round it up we can put the visibility of the base layer back on so we have our middle point, we select this point, rotate tool, to the middle 120 degrees, copy and copy again. Put the visibility of the base layer back off, we select all. Uh, we select the Triskelium and the three wings. Cut. Mm -hmm. Delete these parts. Paste the front. We go to properties and now we can unite them. No idea what happened here, but what the shape builder tool. Yeah, that's better. Invert 
the swap fill on the stroke. And now the design is about finished. We select all, copy, go to our templates documents, paste in front, like this, and we select green. green. The Pagan Pride texts, I'm going to also change in green. And I forgot something. So another detail, detail I'm going to add. Put the visibility of the shake, shape on. Select on, copy. Copy it in a new layer. Change the stroke width to two points. Object path outline stroke shape builder tool. I'm gonna select a light blue. And make the shape in the middle. Select the shape in the middle. Copy it. Lock the layer and put the visibility off. Unlock the Triskelion layer. Paste the shape in the middle. Select all. Shape all the tool. And cut the middle shape out. Like this. Now we can select all. Copy it. Paste it in the template document. Place it in the middle. And change the color to green. OK. Remove the guideline. And our design is finished.